Hey guys, Stacy here with another Let's Play. Before we get started, I wanted to let you guys know a bit of exciting information. I now have a P.O. Box. Yay! I've been wanting to get one for a long time. Quite a few people have mentioned wanting to send me pictures and stuff. So I'm really excited. I'll put the information up on the screen. It's going to be to Stacy Place. I don't actually know if you could put Caden's Winter Pie. I guess you could try. <laughs> we'll see if I get it. But it's going to be P.O. Box 12. Very basic. P.O. Box 12, Wood River Junction, Rhode Island, 02894. Yes, our zip codes in Rhode Island really start with a zero. I get asked that a lot. <laughs> they do. They're zeros. <laughs> anyway, I look forward to receiving stuff from you guys. Um, pictures, postcards would be fun. I was thinking maybe sending postcards back to you guys. Because, I mean, how often do you get a postcard from Rhode Island? Never. <laughs> Anyway, I'm super excited. I look forward to all your letters and stuff, and I'm hoping to hang up stuff on the wall and read stuff for the camera, and, you know, we'll see. I might get two. I might get ten. Who knows? <laughs> we'll go from there. So, yay! <laughs> okay, so now I'm standing here with Loretta because I have not been able to do some of the new quests, like the new mystery girl and Moreland quests, because uh, the Bobcat girls don't like me enough. <laughs> Her face looks like a mask, doesn't it? Because <laughs> I haven't done enough of their quests, so we need to finish this birthday party for Tan, I think. Her face really looks like a mask. Ooh. There, let's just look at her horse. Okay. <laughs> Best decorations uh -huh. ever. Now that all the invitations have been handed out, we have to get everything ready for the party. Seriously, you'll never guess, but I found the best decorations ever. I mean, what's a party without decorations? Especially since we're trying to scare Tan. The decorations are lying in the boxes I've already taken out. It would be awesome if you could help me put them up. Thanks so much! Just be careful, I found some super scary decorations. Make sure you don't get scared to death. She reminds me of that girl in... Scream Queens. <laughs> Let's pick up the other one too. Creepy lights. Have you seen the nice cressets? Cressets I found? Guys, what's a cresset? Cresset. I'm gonna look it up. <laughs> Can you take them outside? Thank you so much. Seriously, those cressets outside will create a really scary atmosphere. Just let me know if you like start getting scared. I guess we'll find out what a cresset is. Oh, oh, look at it. It's so cute. <laughs> Hello, little ghost. <laughs> See, I'm glad I wait. What's that laptop doing there? I'm glad I waited till now to do this quest. It's spooky. Ooh, torches. Oh my gosh, I'm going to be sniffling a lot, and I apologize. <laughs> it's getting cold here, and the weather is driving my allergies crazy. I usually try and edit out any, like, sniffling and sneezing, but I have a feeling it's going to happen a lot. <laughs> Ooh, jack-o'-lanterns! Oh, I'm so excited. Yay! It looks great. This is my new favorite area. At least while it's decorated. <laughs> It all starts to feel a bit strange. <laughs> Use torch. My okay, good. Okay, I got my torch. Oh, nice. That must be what a cress crescent is. Weird. <laughs> all right. Cressets placed. <laughs> no, no. Thanks. So nice of you to offer to help me with this. It's almost worth an invitation to the party. I'm not invited? Hold on a minute. What do you think? Best decorations ever or what? Well, I don't know about best ever, but they are pretty awesome. Oh no, seriously, Cadence, this is a total disaster. What should I do? I have one word for you. Panic! I've forgotten Tan's present down by the stable. She's gonna show up any minute now, and I won't I won't have time to ride down there to get it. How could I have forgotten the present? I'm like the worst friend ever. 
You think you can get it? Are you sure? Oh, so nice of you. If you do this, you could definitely stay for the party. You've earned it. But only if you manage to bring the present here in time. Oh, gosh. Oh, there's a time limit. Oh, shoot. There's a bench. Ah! Oh, gosh. Loretta makes me nervous. Oh, Loretta. It's got to be over here where she normally stands, right? Or not. Did I pass it? Is it showing on my thing? Where's the present? What? Where am I going? Oh, it's down by the stables. Okay. Oops. Oh, there it is. There it is. I hope we make it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's try again. Let's see. All right. We got it. We got it. Okay, Loretta. We got it this time. I hope we can stay for the party. You found it! You're the best! Now you can definitely stay for the party. You can't take this quest while on horseback. Okay. Whew, that was a big jump. Here I am. I'll just stand inside your horse. Congratulations, Tan! You want to stick around, Cadence? Of course you will. It's going to be super fun. Now you can relax and have fun. Ooh! Oh, look at the party! Best party ever! Oh, look at that! Josh, the only boy there. I, I guess because Justin's missing. Oh, my horse is all alone. May's there. Best party ever. Are they chatting? Do I just have it turned down a lot? Oh. Look at that cake. Looks so good. She's on her horse. Best party ever. You have to agree that the party was a total success. I don't know if I managed to scare Tan exactly, but maybe a little? <laughs> she seemed really happy and pleased, so thanks for all the help, Cadence. Now it's just the fun part left. Or not. We have to clean up everything now. We. <laughs> Can you be so nice to stay behind and help me? Great! If you start taking down the decorations and the cressets, I'll do the rest. What rest? Oh, making that vanish? Okay, sure. Aww. I liked the decorations. They were cool. Bye, ghosties. Hello to Kate Panda Knight and Vivian Mighty Heart, who stopped to say hello. It was nice to meet you. Let us continue. Picking up the decorations, even though they're awesome. Torches. Oh, torches. Picked up. Back to its boring self. This area. That was really fun. That be might be one of my favorite quests that I've done. It was cool to see it all decked out in Halloween decorations. Okay. Crescent. Cress, crescent, crescent, I don't know. <laughs> all right, all picked up. Back to lame, lameness. I don't know. Thanks for all the help, Cadence. 
I wouldn't have managed without you. As a thanks for all the help, I've gotten you a little present. Actually, I think it should have been enough that you got to stay for the party, but anyway, I had this riding helmet I didn't want to keep. I got it when I ordered a new pair of shoes, but I already had one like it at home, so you can have it. I have it down by the stables. Ride down there and meet me there so you can get it. Okay. Oh, it's so cute. A thank you present or leftovers? Nah, it's okay. Back in her usual place, I see. There you go. Thanks for all the help, and I hope you had as much fun at the party as I did. If you want to have a pretty, have as pretty clothes as I have, you can buy them at our cool bobcat shop next door. Before I forget, talk to the other girls in bobcats if you want. They probably have stuff they need help with. Okay, thanks. That's our new helmet. It's pretty rad. I like the color. I don't know why the logo is backwards. Oh, on this side it's forwards. On this side, it's backwards. <laughs> it looks like they just flipped, flipped the, this side of the helmet. Anyway, that's all right. It's not as good as the hat I was wearing, but it's fun. <laughs> so I'm still not liked enough with the Bobcats yet to actually buy stuff at their store, but we'll get there. <laughs> all right, let's head in here because Thomas Moreland has a quest. Hmm. Hey Cadence, what an adventure you've had. It's great that some things seem to be in order, but I can sense that new problems are approaching. I don't have any news about my son Justin yet, and we're still looking for him. So far, we have no clues, but we aren't giving up hope. By the way, I heard that James has trouble with some lost tourists at Fort Pinta. Can you please ride to James and see if he needs any help? Thanks for everything, and have a nice day, Cadence. Oh, thank you, Mr. Moreland, sir. Fort Pinta bound. Okay, my apologies to the people who passed by while I was AFK. Hopefully, standing here facing a wall <laughs> helped everyone realize I was AFK. But I came back and a lot of people had said hello. So hello, if I didn't get to say hello to you, my apologies. I was not at the computer. <laughs> but thank you for saying hello anyway. <laughs> That must have been one of the, oh, the lost tourists we're looking for. <laughs> it's like, who is that random guy standing there? Weird. James, we're here about some missing tourists. Oh, hi. It's nice to see you again. I'm having a hard time right now. You know, I, I run this stable and hire out horses for tourists, but now three tourists have disappeared. Oh, no, James. That doesn't surprise me. This is what happened. Three tourists hired horses from me and went out for a ride, but they haven't re re returned to it. <laughs> but they're not very experienced riders, so I give them my most sweet-natured horses. But I'm worried that something has happened or that they have gotten lost. They, sh they should have taken the trail past Doyle's Abbey straight to the north and then continued northeast to Silver Glade Castle via Steve's farm. Please start looking at Doyle's Abbey. Yes, sir. Will do. Doop doop doop. Tight curve. Ooh, that horse, that Shire looks good in pink. The chestnut Shire looks good in pink. Remember that. Well, I know where one guy is because <laughs> I saw him. He had on a funky T-shirt. Funky T-shirt man. Doing the stuff, funky t-shirt man. There he is. What's he wearing? Oh, his camera. Hmm. Gunther. Guten Tag, young miss. My name is Gunther. Yes, I'm the one of the tourists that hired horses at Fort Pinta. Where is my horse and the others, you ask? You could say I'm also wondering about that. Oh, Gunther. <laughs> We were out riding and had a nice trip until my horse suddenly spotted a huge bumblebee and went completely nuts. He ran off with me barely hanging on around his neck and apparently my family couldn't keep up with me. Suddenly the horse stopped, I fell off, and then the horse ran away. Can you help me find it and bring it back to me so I can ride to Fort Pinta? I'm sure that the horse is nearby. I thought I heard it neighing around the eastern side of the Abbey Ruins. Why didn't you go look for it, bro? Man. Gunther. He's too busy standing there doing nothing. Or 
horse. There it is. Yes. Here, horsey, horsey. Oh, okay. Let's herd him back there. Get over there, little buddy. Here's your horse. Hmm. Splendid! There's the nice little horse. Thank you for your help. Now I can ride back to Fort Pinta by myself. Mm -hmm. My wife and daughter, Helga and Gretchen, must have thought that I could take care of myself and continue the ride without me. Go to Steve's farm and to the castle to see if you can find them. I'll return to Fort Pinta and tell James what's happened so he doesn't have to worry. You are more capable of riding around and looking for them than I am, so I think this is the best solution. I agree. <laughs> you, you just go back to Fort Pinta. <laughs> we'll take care of it. Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, no. I'm sorry. I've got some tourists to find. There's one. There's a tourist. Oh, God. Get out of this field. The driver does not like when people are in his field. <laughs> it's going to honk at us, Helga. Where is she? Oh, there's her face. In the ground. Oh, there she is. She's very pretty. Mm -hmm. Hello, my name is Helga. You are, you're out looking for us and you have found Gunther too? That's good. We could really use some help. My daughter Gretchen's horse is stuck in a hole in the ground. That hole? <laughs> we can't get him out. The horse stepped in one of these deep holes and can't get loose. Oh, maybe he's that one. <laughs> I thought he was like totally in the hole. <laughs> Where do all these dangerous holes come from? They're bad for the horses, they are. Oh, you know Steve who has the farm over there? Do you think you can borrow a shovel from him? That's wonderful. Where's the other horse? Hey man, get out of that hole. That non-dimensional hole. It's a flat hole. Hey buddy. Can I borrow a shovel? Mm -hmm. It's bad news that there are holes in the ground. <laughs> that can be dangerous for both people and animals. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Take this shovel and help the poor tourists, but be careful so you don't harm the horse. Bring back the shovel when you're done and tell me what happened. We'll help you, buddy. Nice. Well done. Thanks for your help. Now we can return to Fort Pinta. Thanks for helping us. While you return the shovel to Steve, we'll ride back to Fort Pinta and reunite with Gunther. Maybe we'll see you there later. We'll tell James how kind you've been to help us. James does not care. He'll take credit somehow. I have been trying to get on the wrong horse. There we go. Hmm. Thanks for helping them. What a relief that the horse wasn't hurt. It could have ended really badly. This is true. So you're telling me that these holes are everywhere? They'll destroy my crops and they're dangerous for the horses. Imagine what would have happened if my horses got stuck. Maybe we won't be so lucky next time. Someone or something must have dug those holes and they're too large to be made by mice. Can you scout the area for a while and see if you can find anything suspicious? You can sit in the feeding station next to the holes. Report back if you see anything. Copy that. Peeking. Am I peeking? Still peeking. What did we see? Was I behind the tree? Did I miss it? Steve, I think I missed it. Nothing? Nothing at all? Oh no. You think you're too visible out in the open and that whatever is making those holes will stay hidden as long as you're there? Maybe you're right. Let's think about how you can watch the field without being seen. Hmm. I know. Ride up to Mario at the observatory and ask him if you can use the large telescope. With that, you can watch the field without anyone knowing you're there. The observatory is in the mountains. Oh, I know. We've been working on the gondola lift. 
All right, guys, thanks for joining me today. I appreciate it. We did a few more quests. I think Loretta's spooky birthday party was one of my favorites that I've done so far. I liked her decorations. Um, and don't forget my new P.O. Box, Stacy Place, P.O. Box 12, Wood River Junction, Rhode Island, 02894. I hope to see some letters coming in soon. I'm so excited. <laughs> and look forward to a training video here with Dragon Rain who is so big and sometimes rather awkward to race. So <laughs> you're going to love that. <laughs> anyway, I will see you guys again soon. Bye.